Changing a drawing document can be triggered in several ways. For example, an email sent by a project partner or a file from a colleague containing breadline information. In this demonstration, we will use an Outlook email already saved as an MSG file and organized, containing several remarks for a microstation drawing. Although the content of the email can be viewed in the internal viewer of Organize, we will open the email in Outlook. Checkout is not necessary because we will not change the content. After examining the email message, we know that the land acquisition reference file is missing in the main drawing. We use the listed file name to search for the main drawing. The search result on the left-hand side shows the drawing that should contain the missing reference file. In the document list in the middle of the screen, the selected document is highlighted. We're going to add the reference file by checking out the drawing. Double-clicking the application icon in the document list will ask the user if he wants to check out the document for editing or if he wants to open it read-only. We select Yes to check out the document. The document is automatically copied to the local cache and opened in the linked application MicroStation V8XM. After zooming into the correct location inside the drawing, we select the Attach Reference button on the Organized toolbar that is part of the MicroStation integration. The Organize interface will show an open dialog box enabling the user to select the correct reference file. We switch back to the email to get the correct search keywords for the missing reference file. The name field inside the document list is used to filter by using the file name. After the correct drawing is selected, the Reference Attachment Settings dialog box will invite the user to place the reference file inside the main drawing. The drawing is present in the standard MicroStation dialog boxes. After the reference file is attached correctly, we will check in the drawing. Of course, checking in a document will always pop up the property dialog box, enabling the user to change the database entries and to fill in a revision comment. In this example, the document will be checked in as a major version. After this, the document is uploaded to the SharePoint server and will be unlocked for colleagues. In Organize, we select the Change Drawing and notice that the changes are visible in the internal viewer. We can also use the Batch tab to show the reference structure of the drawing. Simply drag the main drawing on the Batch tab and the structure will be visible.